Hey guys, my name is Sven, and this is Dragon Age Inquisition. I sadly never really played the other two Dragon Age games, but I did spend a lot of time watching my friend play the first, and I want to thank him for buy, pretty much buying me this game, because he wanted somebody to talk to about it. YOLO or something like that. Now I did kind of already start it out just very quickly just to see the character creation options because I didn't want to spend eight and a half hours on it. You know what I mean? So I am going to go with a human and I really want to be an archer and normal. Okay. I really wanted to pick the, the, oh, sorry. No. Default world state. Cool. Got it. I really wanted to pick the the Kunari because they look badass as shit in the picture, but they're like gigantic, like hulking beasts. And I know it's really, really, really fucking lame, but I don't know. Like when I play these like role playing games, you know, you kind of want to get into it a little bit. And I really didn't like how gigantic my character was because I just started out just very quickly to see what they looked like in the world and stuff. And he was huge. I'm a baby, I know. You can make fun of me as much as you want, but it's a fucking role-playing game with character creation. Like, what else can you really expect? I guarantee you there are, there are people who are much worse than I. That's what I want to go with. <laughs> I think I saw that dude the last time I was in Williamsburg. Um, I kind of like that, those face tattoos, though. Um, no, I don't want to mess with that. I want to go to general. Face shape. <laughs> um. No, I kind of want to look less like a weirdo. I like that one. Damn, he is white now. Like straight up white. I'll take a more pinkish. I kind of want to make him look a little bit younger, I feel like. There we go. That's pretty cool. Eye color. Hair. I don't want to be bald. I'll take that one. That, that's actually kind of close to my actual haircut. Yeah. Beard. I would like to look, look a little tiny bit less like a hipster. Nothing wrong with the hipsters, but... That mustache is too much for me. I can't handle it. Can't hack it. And I don't like PBR that much. God, if anybody watches this video, they're going to fucking hate me for that. But it's okay. Eh, maybe I'll keep that and the little bit of scruffiness. Because I don't really want to do, like, full-ass beard shit. You know what I mean? As long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. I just hope I can help. I like that one. Oh wait, shit. I just hope I can help. How much is this going to cost me exactly? I like that one. I can dig it. Scars and tattoos. Tattoo design. Let's see them the, them face tats. Um Let's see. I kind of maybe nah. Let me see. Let me see what else it has to offer. So that's nothing. Yeah, I kind of like that one a little bit. Oh wait, no, I don't want to do that. Give me the red. Give me the red.
Yeah, well, let me let me see what the other ones look like in red. I'm really weird, I'm sorry. Actually, I kind of like that a lot. Yeah, that's the one. You know, fun fact, there are actually, uh, there is a pretty, uh, big trend in tattoos with the dots and stuff. Like, especially on the face. Which I find pretty interesting. I would never do it, but... Um, I, I, I think that that's it. Maxwell, no thank you. Um... Surprise, surprise, gonna name him Sven. Man, I'm sexy as shit. That's what I look like in real life. No, obviously not, but... I'm gonna get myself some trouble now. Start out in a dungeon, probably. Run, Forest, run! But yeah, one of the reasons why I picked an archer is because every everything that everybody's talked about with this game is that like you're you're not necessarily like married to your subclass. So if you pick like a rogue, you can start out with archer and then go to like a, a dual wield later and stuff. And I want to kind of, you know, maybe shoot from a distance at first and then kind of maybe move to being kind of proficient at both. At least that's how I played Skyrim. <clears throat> I'm in trouble. Tell me why we shouldn't kill you now. The Conclave is destroyed. Everyone who attended is dead. Except for you. Okay, I always play these games as a good guy. I'm really sorry, but that's just the way I do it. What do you mean everyone's dead? Explain this. I can't. What do you mean you can't? I don't know what that is. Or how it got there. You're lying! We need him, Cassandra. Some dialogue... Get, er, excuse me. Some dialogues give you the opportunity to respond emotionally to situations. When these opportunities appear, special icons will highlight the emotion tied to the response. Let me go. No, I don't, I don't want to be aggressive. I'll be sad. I'll phone it in, you know, maybe get some, uh... A little bit of, uh... All those people... dead? Do you remember what happened? How this began? I remember running. Things were chasing me, and then... a woman. A woman? She reached out to me, but then... <sighs> Go to the Ford Camp Liliana. I will take him to the rift. What did happen? It will be easier to show you. It 
It's a massive rift into the world of demons that grows larger with each passing hour. It's not the only such rift, just the largest. All were caused by the explosion at the Conclave. An explosion can do that? This one did. Unless we act, the breach may grow until it swallows the world. Each time the breach expands, your mark spreads, and it is killing you. It may be the key to stopping this, but there isn't much time. Okay, so this is similar to like Mass Effect where you can kind of investigate a little bit. You say it may be the key to doing what? Closing the breach. Whether that's possible is something we shall discover shortly. It is our only chance, however. And yours. You still think I did this? To myself? Not intentionally. Something clearly went wrong. And if I'm not responsible? Someone is. And you are our only suspect. You wish to prove your innocence? This is the only way. Yeah, I'll be nice guy. You know, try to help out. I understand. Then... I'll do what I can. Whatever it takes. She was, like, taken aback by that. Yeah, yeah. Fuck you, lady. They have decided your guilt. They need it. The people of Haven mourn our most holy, divine Justinia, head of the Chantry. The conflict <coughs> was hers. It was a chance for peace between mages and Templars. She brought their leaders together. Now they are dead. <sighs> we lash out like the sky, but we must think beyond ourselves, as she did. Until the breach is sealed. Are you going to cut me up? There will be a trial. I can promise no more. Come. It is not far. Where are you taking me? Your mark must be tested on something smaller than the breach. Okay. Oh, I can jump. My creator jump. Yeah. Skip in. Skip into the rift. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to, to skip on you, dude. Skip in. Open skip the gate. in. We are heading into the valley. Okay. Now I'll stop fucking around. Okay. To access the quest map from hero menu by pressing options. I don't care. Don't care. I'm like, this isn't my first rodeo with a video game. I'm going to take the while so I'm just going to say that there probably isn't much for me until I I'll go a little bit further. The pulses are coming faster now. The larger the breach grows, the more... You know, I'll go at like a leisurely slow stroll, excuse me. The they said you stepped out of a rift. Then fell unconscious. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. No one knows who she was. Everything farther in the valley was laid waste, including the Temple of Sacred Ashes. I suppose you'll see soon enough. Oh, for a second, for a second, I thought I thought like there was like a weird texture going on there. Still skip in. Damn, they got fucked up there. What the fuck is that? Convenient. That's the exact weapon of the class I picked. It's very nice of them to help me out like that. 
Press R2 to attack. Okay. Oh, shit. R2 to continuously attack. Okay. I kind of know how video games work. Sometimes. Come on. Please stop it, you fucking asshole. Please? I love how what I said was like... It's over. Drop your weapon. Now. Alright, fine. Saved your ass, but... Gotta be a dick about it. Wait. I cannot protect you. And I cannot expect you to be defenseless. I should remember you agreed to come willingly. Okay, so this is... What does that do? Attack target. Disengage. Okay. Take these potions. Maker knows what we will face. Where are all your soldiers? So do Back I the forward camp for fighting? Do I have we are on our own for now? Do I have unlimited a ammo pretty much? I guess so. Whatever. Scout helmet. Uh inventory. Armor. Whatever. I guess that kind of defeats the purpose of having a fucking haircut, but... Still sexy, though. But yeah, what that is there is the illusion of choice. No matter what was going to happen there, I would have... Either way, ended up keeping my weapons. Fun fact. There! Watch out! If we flank them, we may gain the advantage. Okay, cool. So I can be invisible. Awesome. That's uh, that's actually pretty cool, the auto lock. You can just die. I don't even care that much about you. What's your name? Cassandra? Yeah, like, you can just fuck off. I don't even give a shit. Can I shoot her? I wish. Can I loot anybody? Lootin. M one of my favorite things to do. The lootin'. No loot. There's the loot! Loot! See, it's even called loot! What is this, fucking Diablo? All about the loot. Um, where did those enemies die? Because I thought that they were up here. Can I not loot them? Okay, fine. Fuck you guys, then. Ooh, I see an enemy. Okay, so it seems like when I when I lock and stuff, I I do more uh, damage. It seems like I could be wrong, but God damn it! Can you die? Awesome, Jesus! That took forever. You know what? She can fuck off. I don't even care about her if she dies. Actually, no, I'll help her because I'm a nice guy sometimes. Oh, shit. Doing some crits up in this. Up in this bitch. And I can loot. All that loot. Okay. So I guess let's keep going. Maybe? Let me see if I can loot that wraith that was up here. Ah, cool. But maybe there is something over here. Fun fact, always explore shit in these sorts of games. You will not regret it. <coughs> hmm. Where else can I go now? I mean, I'm sure that there isn't really that much to see. God damn it. Where did you go? 
Okay, so there's the rifty thingy majigger. Ooh, shit. That's not very nice, guys. Damn, how many of these guys are gonna fucking gang up on us? Alright, yeah, you're gonna die. Uh-oh. Come on. There you go. There we go. I hope I level up soon. Because leveling up is the best thing ever. Level up your game. Level it up. Jump. Yay. Let me see if there's any loot over here. But yeah, like, what I was saying before about the illusion of choice is that... It, like, Mass Effect, like, Bioware in general is, like, probably one of the best companies when it comes to the illusion of choice in that almost everything you do and say in those games have real no impact on the actual state of the game, but it makes you think it does. And that's cool. I actually really like the Mass Effect games... I actually really You'll see soon. We must help them. I actually really 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 like the Mass Effect games. I really hope that they do a uh, collection for the PS uh, PS4 and Xbox 1. Cuz that would be really really cool. Yeah. Donkey Kong. But yeah, as I said, I really would love to see them do a new um collection of those games for the new consoles because that would be pretty cool especially with how good this game looks i would love to see mass effect in this same like graphical style because the mass effect games did look really good but i mean they, like they weren't the best ever Okay. So I guess I can help. At least this is good for something. Whatever magic opened the breach in the sky also placed that mark upon your hand. I theorized the mark might be able to close the rifts that have opened in the breach's wake. And it seems I was correct. Meaning it could also close the breach itself. Possibly. Whoa, what happened there? It seems you hold the key to our salvation. Good to know. Here I thought we'd be ass deep in demons forever. Varric Tethras, rogue, storyteller, and occasionally unwelcome tag along. <laughs> You're with the Chantry. Are you with the Chantry or? <laughs> Was that a serious question? Technically, I'm a prisoner, just like you. I brought you here to tell your story to the Divine. Clearly, that is no longer necessary. Yet, here I am. Lucky for you, considering current events. You know, I kind of just want to be like, nice crossbow. That's a nice crossbow you have there. Ah, isn't she? Bianca and I have been through a lot together. You named your crossbow Bianca? Of course. And she'll be great company in the valley. Absolutely not. Your help is appreciated, Varric, but... Have you been in the valley lately, Seeker? Your soldiers aren't in control anymore. You need me. Ugh. My name is Solus, if there are to be introductions. I am pleased to see you still live. He means I kept that mark from killing you while you slept. He knows about it. You seem to know a great deal about it all. Solus is an apostate, well versed in such matters. Technically, all mages are now apostates, Cassandra. My travels have allowed me to learn much of the Fade, far beyond the experience of any circle mage. I came to offer whatever help I can give with the breach. If it is not closed, we are all doomed, regardless of origin. 
That's commendable. That's a commendable attitude. Merely a sensible one. Although sense appears to be in short supply right now. Cassandra, you should know. The magic involved here is unlike any I've seen. Your prisoner is no mage. Indeed, I find it difficult to imagine any mage having such power. Understood. <coughs> we must get to the forward camp quickly. Well... Bianca's excited. I mean... If that's what you want to call it, go for it, dude. This way, down the bank. The road ahead is blocked. We must move quickly. Okay, fine. I'll go with you assholes. Yeah! My jump comes in handy. Yes, I knew there was going to be fucking loot here. I knew that shit. Figuring... Figuring of Mafrath the Betrayer. Oh, actually, you know what? I totally want to use a healing potion. Iron. Cool. Gather herbs and metals out in the wild and use them to craft upgrades to your gear and potions. Explore and find as many varieties as you can. Okay. Thank you, game. That is very nice of you. I see some motherfuckers over there. They're gonna get shot with my arrows. Press. What? Ta t while in tactical camera, use the left stick to scan the battlefield. Use R3 to cycle through targets. Switch control between your party members as, as you attack or something. Okay, this is pretty cool, I guess. I don't know if I'm ever going to use it. Um. Um, how do I control the different party members? You know what? I don't really give that much of a shit. Wait, where's my guy? Oh, there we go. That's how I do it. Okay. So it's pretty much like just up and down on the uh, control or the uh, D-pad makes you do it. So it's like, where's an enemy? It's like attack, attack. Yeah, so it's kind of like that. Okay. That's pretty cool, I guess. God, I... Uh, I, I just actually pressed down on the uh, L2 to aim. I've been playing too many games that have that sort of control scheme lately. Because I'm a dummy or something like that. Oh, fuck. I'm about to die, aren't I? Shit. Yo, you're, you're going to get shot up now. Can I use a potion? Yes, I can. Awesome. Oh, did he give me, like, a little speed boost? Thanks, dude. You're so nice to me. Is he gonna be one of the, uh, the boning options? Because, let's be real here. This is a Bioware game. So, there's obviously going to be a lot of different options for the bonings. So, ooh, what's in there? Silver bracelet. I will take that shit. Can I go up there? I want to sleep in the bug bed, damn it. Let me get into the bug bed. No, okay, fine. Um, is there anything else in here that I can loot? Sure is. C canine leather. Aw. That's a bear head also. Everybody getting ready. Yeah, that was really cool, actually. Everybody put it away at the same time. Oh, that's a bear trap. Can I, like, disarm that shit or anything? No, I can't even trigger it. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna go around the side, see if there's anything to loot over here. I'm really sorry. It's just, like, all of these games, like, even when I'm playing, like, The Evil Within and stuff, you need to explore a little bit. Like, shit. Yeah. But you, you need to explore. Like, it takes all the fucking fun out if you don't explore at all. And that shit is really boring if you don't do any exploring at all. Sorry, B. 
doubt you, but it's just... It's true. If you deny that I am the bringer of truth in that statement, then you are lying to yourself. Ah, oh, yes. More loot. See? And I know, and I kind of said it before, but... Like, a lot of people just, you know, like, try to get through these games as quick as possible, especially when they're playing it, them on the internet for other people to see and stuff. Ooh. Herb. Got that herb. But a lot of people, you know, just kind of want to get through the games and call it a day on that. I just, I'm, I'm too much of a completionist to do that kind of shit. Too much. Oh, well. Is there, like, a fucking run button or something? Because I really just want to... You know, fucking... Oh, no! Move on with everything, I guess. Would be the word I'm looking for. I mean, I'll just let everybody attack. Like, I don't really want to mess with that, uh... Mode too much. The, uh... RTS mode. Because I just don't care. Really. I mean... Like, if, if I really start seeing shit get, like, really fucked up, I'll totally do it, but... Until then, I'm fine. Because I really doubt that the game would put me in a position where I couldn't just win like this. So if I if I get into a... I take it you're from the free marches. Oh, accent. Oof. I'm from Kirkwall, but you're from uh, further east, maybe? So as I said, if I, if I get to a point... Oh. Very perceptive. Yeah, like in the bedroom. I'm surprised you didn't make that joke. Why did I have to make the fucking joke? Ooh. Elf root. Cool. But I have, I have, however, heard that this game is pretty difficult to a certain extent. So hopefully I won't die too many times. Okay, so where am I actually supposed to go now? Oh, quest map. Okay. Oh, shit. I'm a dumbass. Okay. Well, at least I got some loot out of it. Oh, I see it now. Okay, okay. I got it. Now I know what I'm supposed to be doing. I know it's difficult, but we must keep moving. I'm trying to, lady. You're the one who keeps stopping me to chit-chat about shit. Oh my god, did he really just say that? Premature execution. I think there's a pill for that. Okay, so here we go, I guess. Now, let me guess. Everything's fucked up and I'm gonna have to kill some enemies. Yes. Damn, he got... He got fucked up there. Oh, he is frozen, and I'm probably going to die soon. Oh, well. At least any, anything is better than a premature... I God, I almost fucking said premature ejaculation. I really did. Wow. It's early. I need more coffee. I'm sorry. Maybe, maybe I'm just a pervert. I don't know. No, I'm not a pervert. I promise. Okay. So... I really hope that the game stops giving me so many conversations in between stuff just because of the fact that, like, I appreciate it, but the thing is, is, like, if I'm recording this shit, I don't really want to have to stop every time one of them starts, like, uh, chit-chatting with the other ones, you know what I mean? So, I don't know. Disrupt Rift. Come on. Yeah, I'm damaging all the demons. F yeah. Miracle. Where, where are they? Come on. 
Oh, they're all fucking dead now. Aw, oh, cool, I level up. This increases your health and stats automatically and awards you one ability point to use. Uh, press option to open the hero member menu and select character record to see the ability screen. Okay. Abilities, okay. So now I'm in... Oh, so there are four different things, okay. Tactics, okay. Cooley, okay. Okay, I got it. Leave me alone. Okay, I got it. Okay, so double daggers. Experts in these style are fast and deadly. Because I do, as I said before, I do really want to eventually at least um, toy with it a little bit. But, and what's sabotage? Experts in these talents specialize in po poisons and traps. They're dirty tricks. I don't really care that much about that. Subterfuge. Experts in these talents are masters of misdirection, whether leaping to safety, disappearing into the shadows, or tricking enemies into slashing at empty air. They're never where anyone expects them to be. Bump, bump, bump. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, since I have two points to spend, that is long shot. You, power, you fire a powerful single shot that delivers more damage the farther you, oh, now that, I get it now. Okay, I'm a dumbass. You do more damage. Is that a passive or is that an active? I think that that might be a passive. First blood. You learn to pick apart enemies that are still unwounded and unwary. Um, because I think that yes, okay. So I'm assuming that these are passive, and the squ are the not squares. The diamonds are active abilities. So I have two things to spend. I don't know what I want. I'm gonna I'm gonna upgrade the long shot, I think. Cool. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do this. Learn that shit too. I'm gonna apply. Awesome. And I got a trophy. I'm so cool. I'm gonna go to details really quickly. So Cunning, offensive, attack is 2%, guard damage, okay. Critical damage bonus, of course, I'm an archer, so I probably... Main hand damage, offhand damage, okay. Um, 